it's it, it's a good fundraiser. Um, it's it's very intense labor wise, um, but very fun because you're working with people um, that have the same goal in mind is to raise money for our campfire club programs and our summer camp program. We are selling phantom fireworks, the safe and sane, and um, so people just want to be careful with uh, you know there's no discharging of fireworks on the beaches um, because if you were caught doing that um, you know it's illegal so it's a couple thousand dollar fine um, for that and you don't want anything that's shooting up in the air that might you know land on somebody's roof you always want to make sure that you have water um, available uh, even though water is a scarcity uh, but you want to have a bucket of water um, be with lighting it and you want to make sure that you're not lighting it in your hand so I'll just read off um, some of the safety tips from the five cities fire authority um, dispose of fireworks in a container of water and do not attempt to relight a piece that doesn't go off do not approach or move such a piece for at least 30 minutes and select a firing site free of overhead wires, obstacles such as trees or branches, and away from homes. And never alter or modify uh, or enhance fireworks. Use only as directed. So you always want to make sure you read the directions of the fireworks before uh, lighting them. And burns caused by fireworks can be more serious than you, they first appear. So if you're concerned, you need to check out with a family physician or go to the hospital emergency room. And never wear lot, nylon, loose clothing or materials that burn quickly when setting up fireworks. Remember that fireworks are made from explosives and they are unpredictable.